All right, and here is the helmet stand. This thing is super easy to print. It really works with just about any variety of helmets that you have. This is created by Sentinel Props. It's available over on Thingiverse for you to download. He saw a design that Hot Toys has created for one of their replica prop or one of their rec replica Iron Man action figures. And he took that design and ran with it and created a version that you can print full size for your 3D printed helmets. I think this looks really incredible. This printed super easily on my CR10. I printed this in 0.3 millimeter layer height with about 10% infill and it took just a little over two days to print. Printed it in the Uncle Jesse Ziltec Gunmetal PLA. Wink, 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 wink. I can't wink for some reason today. And then once printed, it was super easy to assemble. There's a cap piece that you can use that has a hole in it that you can then buy a PVC pipe, or I used a wooden dowel here that I had from an old curtain rod that I cut that I was able to slide right through that available hole opening. I also used some foam on the base of it to give it some support for the rod so it's not moving around. One thing that I might be interested in doing, or I might reach out back to the designer and see if they can make a small circular base entry there that the rod can then slide through not only the top, but also the bottom so it's not moving around so much. It's a really simple design. I'm not planning on finishing this at all, just leaving it as 3D printed. I might print another one of these at 0.2 millimeter layer height just to see what the results are. At 0.3, I thought this turned out great. And again, I'm not really interested in finishing this at all or sanding it even. I just basically removed the supports, threw the helmet on here, and it's good to go for what I needed to do. It's just gonna look cool and help support the helmets so that they're not just sitting flat on my shelf here. I should also mention that Sentinel Props has a variety of other helmet stands. Right now, I've printed the Ant-Man helmet stand. I need to pick up a crew. Uh I need to pick up a clear acrylic rod. Man, that was so hard for me to say for some reason. I need to pick up a clear acrylic rod that I can use to insert into the base here to help support the helmet once it's on the stand. But again, a really simple but very cool looking design for Ant-Man helmet. He has a variety of other helmet files as well that you can go and check out as long, uh, helmet stand files I should say, along with cosplay related files that you can go off and, and print for yourself. Really cool stuff over there. All right, really quick video for you guys. I just wanted to share this with you. I thought this was a really cool, very easy project for you to do in one week and you can crank it out and easily have something cool to display your props on that you've created. And again, it's pretty universal, even though he created it for Iron Man, I think the design of it is pretty nicely done that it would work really with any kind of helmet, not just Iron Man. So I'm looking forward to having more of these printed and being able to better display some of the props that I've created here on my back wall. So thanks again for watching, you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. Let me know down in the comments what you think of the helmet stand here. If you thought that was a cool project file, make sure to go check out the link down below to Sentinel Props where you can check out and print one for yourself as well. Hey, thanks again for watching, you guys, and I will see y'all next time. Bye now.